The carrick bend is a delightfully symmetrical knot that's used to join two ropes together. When tied in larger ropes, the working ends are seized and it's left flat, as you see here. In smaller ropes, it's drawn up into a pair of interlocking bites and collars. We draw up a right-handed loop in the first rope and then drape the second rope parallel to the standing part of the first. To tie the carrick bend, we're going to weave the second rope, passing under, over, under, over, under. Now once you're familiar with the knot, you won't need to lay it out flat like this, but it helps to tie it this way a few times in the beginning just to make sure you have the pattern of crossings down pat. To tie in the hand, draw up a right-handed loop, then drape the second rope over the top of it. Pinch the two together in the right-hand corner, and then use the fingers of the left hand to weave the working end around. Tug oppositely on the working ends and standing parts to pull the slack out of the knot and give the standing parts a good tug to form the knot up. If you'd like to learn how to seize the ends for larger cables, be sure to stop by my video on the constrictor knot.